Hey there. We're on the 2nd of September, 2018, and... Got it. No matter how I position this, I can't get Venus. If you can see that... Here, let me do this. Okay, Venus is not that star blinking up there. It's down in the trees, but... Well, let's see who you are. We'll have to look on the app. Yeah. We don't know who you are, but... Well, I think I finally filmed the last of my evening star. I'm gonna have to wait till it's morning star again. But anyway, that's in the southwest, as is Jupiter. And since we already have the 3x zoom on, let's go on up there. Take a look at the big guy. Alrighty, they're not going to come in the greatest with the color of the sky we have right now, but Jupiter's in the lead tonight with Callisto heading up the rear there. It's so cool to see it. But anyway, I don't want to make this video too long tonight, so... Oops, I didn't mean to do that. And there we go, with uh, Jupiter itself. As it's descending for this Sunday evening. I think it's Sunday. I don't know. Cool planet with its moons. Alright, you keep on descending and we'll try to find Saturn and Mars. And you know what? That's going to do it for now. All right, so we're going to put Jupiter to bed. There's that part of the sky. And we're going to go in search. All right, I don't see Mars in the trees, but it's there. <laughs> All right, I do want to get a different angle. All right, let's do this first before I get another angle. Okay, I can barely see it blinking, but, well, let me do this. Yeah, I can barely see it blinking, but around the eight o'clock position is Titan. It's just way too grainy. And that makes it too hard to see, but anyway. There's at least one moon of Jupiter, or not Jupiter, Saturn. And here we go. So with Venus low in the southwest and Jupiter in the southwest, Saturn's over here in the southern sky, or south, southeast, and then Mars will be in the southeast. Ah, I do see a little flicker of light in the trees of Mars. That's why I have to go uh, get a different angle. Yeah, I bang on about it all the time, but damn, Saturn's a cool planet. <laughs> uh, and it's early. It's 8.32 p.m. now. The sun set at 7.56. No, 7.54. All right, that's enough of the ring one here. Now we're gonna go and search a different angle. Okay, you might be able to see the twinkle in the lower left in the tree branches. But we're going to go on the other side of the willow. On the rocks. Okay. So, a berate Saturn 
Down here. It's Mars. Okay, now we have our orange one rising. Yet another cold planet. It's too bad that the camera equipment I have can't get uh, Neptune or Uranus or Pluto. But these aren't a telescope, so as I keep reminding myself. <laughs> Now it's going to be after 1 a.m. before the moon rises above the trees for me, so. And I think it'll be about 49% or so, 48, something like that. So unless I pack up all this gear in the middle of the night, I'm not going to be getting it yet again. <laughs> oh, well. Well, listen, this is good enough for now. Just got our short documentation. And so there's a shot of the of the wide V <laughs> of the Antares down there in the lower middle of the screen and Jupiter off to the right, Saturn to the left. And there we go. Oh, you know what? I keep forgetting to mention a good old Arcturus up there. It's one of the few stars that I can see by. So I just wanted to give him a shout out tonight. <laughs> And it's over in the western sky. Anyway, okay, there we go. I hope you're all having a great weekend. And for those in the States, a safe holiday too. Y'all take care, have fun. <laughs> Bye now.